Sponsored by aim to game Servers. Hey everyone, welcome back to FTB Horizons Daybreaker with Teddy here. In episode number seven, aim to game Thank you! Yes, <laughs> server sponsored by aim to game Thank you. Yes, server hosting things aim to game They set us up with this nice, wonderful server. It's been doing an awesome job and <laughs> chugging through Horizons for us. It's been doing a pretty good job, Teddy. Been doing good since we upgraded it to a little bit larger. Oh yeah, definitely for sure. <laughs> so Teddy, um, we got a uh, a guest today. Yeah. I see. Mm -hmm. He looks Hello. oddly familiar somehow. <laughs> Hello, Shade Hunter. How you doing, man? No, 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 no! Don't you hide from the camera. Oh, you can't hide. <laughs> You'll never hide. Look, do you see how fast I am? <laughs> You'll never hide from me. <laughs> I can I can slow down time. And, this and, is uh yeah so uh, yeah. I'll just do a little <laughs> introduction. This is Shade Hunter. He messaged me on Facebook. He is a uh, disabled veteran. Is that correct? Yep. And uh, going through some rough times, and he said our videos really helped him out a lot, and that he would like to possibly, in a very polite letter, I must add. Uh, played with us a little bit. I said, you know what? I'm a veteran. He's a disabled veteran. Why not? Let's do it. And there I he is. a good idea. And he's freaking out like just a little bit. <laughs> he's freaking out just a little bit. Well, man, I'm glad to have you on. I think it's actually pretty cool. I've been meaning to want to do some stuff like this, and honestly, I have had no clue on how to go about um, being able to play with other people, like fans and stuff like that. It's hard to do, like, with large amounts of people yes. because servers and stuff, expensive and stuff. And you have a lot of fans. Yeah. Sponsors, skin with lots of fans like that, it's kind of hard to do sometimes. But Right. Um, so this is it's really nice. I think it's pretty cool. And here, this is some crappy armor you can wear. Yeah, you can wear that crappy armor. Don't worry. Enjoy. I will master it. Hey, if you want, I don't know. You might like mine more. Here, you can have mine. <laughs> That's how much we don't like that armor. Here's a pickaxe, too, pickaxe. I'm not using. You can have this. Crash too. landing. I can't clone myself. You can shoot Teddy with that. Uh, that no. No. And uh, here's some pork chops. Crossbow. I shaved off Teddy somehow. Look, dude, he's looking good, man. Are you call me fat. Anyway, so you'll enjoy those. Those are freshly cooked. Um, very, very greasy. They're very good. What just happened? Can I make a small chest to put my books in it so they're not in my inventory? Actually, I just put them in this chest here. A yeah. uh, backpack, if you want to. Even I think we got all the stuff. If you want to make them a backpack. Oh yeah, we got tons of stuff over here. More than welcome. Oh, yeah. So, I'm going to be doing a little bit of work in uh, some clockwork phase. I left off last episode doing some work in clockwork phase. Teddy, you actually left off doing... <gasps> Skeleton! Don't die! Don't die! No, don't go in there! Darn it! Why? Why? What? What just happened? <sighs> There's a skeleton. Okay. I was going to kill that skeleton, and uh, I've been working on my soul shard. Oh. I, uh, you know that one that you have maxed out, but for blazes? Yeah. Because I sat yeah, for been... hours at a blaze spawner, <laughs> letting wooden spikes take him down to one health. <laughs> and, and Teddy somehow managed to get on a soul sword, which is easily made by using a little bit of a solium and iron to make a soul sword. Don't say uh, somehow. Managed... Don't say somehow. Manage somehow. You watch me put it in there. You're a jerk. <laughs> to get a level 30 enchant was might 4 and soul stealer 4, which... For every level of soul stealer, if I'm not mistaken, grants another soul to your soul shard. Yes. So I don't see how this yeah. is a problem. <laughs> it's not. You're like, you, you cheated. Just, You're a I, cheater. You are a cheater. I did cheater, not cheat. Man. Whatever. You didn't cheat, and I know you didn't cheat, but... <laughs> God, you're so mean. I am. I don't know what's wrong with me. I've been working on my fancy new building. I've been trying to come up with a new style for my... Uh, my building. I'm trying to get it away from yours because I think yours has cooties or something. So, you would. You're just mean. <laughs> oh, I don't know. There's mean blood in my my in my blood. 
That makes um, total sense coming from you somehow. Yeah, exactly. Oh my God. <laughs> um, do I don't want you have a pick. You can pick this block up, please. I accidentally placed. Uh, sure. Where at? Uh, right above you. Oh yeah. I, I think I threw you a... Didn't I throw you a magnanimous uh, pickaxe? Oh, there it is. You did. I feel Okay. Cool. No. Um, it's, it's cool. We <laughs> lose stuff all the time in our inventory. I was like, yeah, exactly. I also was like, uh, did, cannot those pickaxes not break iron blocks? <laughs> no, yeah, they cannot. Quite a few times, Bentley, I've been watching a video, and I'm like, dude, I'm like, uh, you have it in your inventory. It's right now there. you know why. It's totally it's different. It's sad. It's rubbing off. I don't know if that's a good thing. It's rubbing off onto other people. I hope that isn't happening to everyone that's watching the videos. It is. <laughs> that would be horrible. So we got some yellow dye somewhere, or somewhere, don't we? No. Um, I would say no, sir. <sighs> I need some ore. Sure, we'll just use some gold. I'm going to convert, and I'm going to get me some more, because I think I've maxed out my clockwork pickaxe. I have two hours and 46 minutes worth of time sand thus far and i've tried to put more on there but it just doesn't go so i think it's practically maxed out at this point probably is because you're a cheater yes. <laughs> says the guy with the soul stealer four and smite four sword that i no idea so what you're talking me. about no <laughs> against idea. skeletons there's a skeleton on my mini map here and i have no clue where he's at he's, he's hiding from you because he doesn't like you well <gasps> i see him so, have you noticed the... Notice what? <laughs> notice the fairy floating around? What? Did... I was... You building yeah, a wall yeah, of exactly. gold around us or what? Oh, I'm so sorry. You don't <laughs> see that, but I do not see anything. Oh, here, <laughs> let me break them. There you go. Yeah, but no, I do see that fairy floating around your face. And he's been he's been floating around me too. Yeah. He's What's cool. that all about? Uh that is my uh glider fairy. He negate he doesn't take away completely fall damage, but he, he takes away a little bit. So I'm gonna make you a ring so you can make your own fairy. Okay. That sounds fair enough. Oop. Um is it any type of ring that I want, or is it just that specific ring that you actually have? It's got to be a the ring that I have, but then you can put your own okay. fairies on it. Know what I'm saying? I'm a little confused. The, about the fairies, fairies are like a module, you know, like like a item that you can put in the ring. Oh, so you mean like those um, modular armor rings that actually I put a magnet on with leadstone uh, battery, and it doesn't work for nothing? Yes, except these work. Oh, except those work. Oh, that's sold. I'm sold. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to get this powered up, and hopefully we got enough going through. Oh, hey, come back here. All right. Two of those guys. And this oh, may man. take a bit. I may have to make more blue aura. No, I should be uh -oh. all right. I should be all right. It is going to take a while, though, because it needs... It does sound... To me, it's a little grindy for you. Yeah, this is a lot grindy. I spent last night. <laughs> Shade Hunter messaged me. He's like, hey, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm sitting here making ingots. <laughs> I made like a blast. I made 22 of each color ingot. And it took me like, mm, I probably could have automated it and stuff. But it took like, ooh, about hour and a half, maybe? I think hour and a half sounds right. Jeez, man! Oh, 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 oh! Wait, wait! Oh, come here! Come here! Come here! Jeez, man! Now! I'm, I'm coming! People have to see this. They have to see it. It's amazing. It's amazing. Um. Okay, this setup. Okay, violet aura, right? Okay. All right. I see it. Violet multiplies itself. With the more uh, uh, aura nodes you have. Okay, okay. so it g gains in strength. So I've been using that mechanic. Okay, to very slowly 
Make Angel Steel. For free. For free. For free. Now, but these are all involved. these are all first degree steel. It's all first Angel Steel the first degree. So you take three of these, Angel Steel the all first right. degree, and you throw them on the ground. And then they turn into an Angel Steel the second degree. So you see how it oh. gets Ah, yeah. okay. So if I if you have like stacks of this in here, and when you're not online, I come in here and I throw it all on the ground, it'll turn it'll itself able... into the next level. You'd be upset with me. Not really, because I want to get high level angel steel. Oh, okay. <laughs> my pickaxe is happy is, with a, me is what you're saying. Yeah, my pickaxe is a third degree. It automatically has fortune one on it. No way. Let me do that. Just mouse over. Okay. Fortune, oh, what's Angels Shatter? I'm not sure on that yet. And Angels Disintegrate. I'm not sure on that yet. Oh, nice. Wow. No dur that it doesn't take durability nice. either. That's really no, nice. it takes no durability damage. Oh, that's so really nice. Really nice. But if I, I want to like speed this over. up, I can always, you know, boost these up. I can always throw some coal down here and get those going. And it'll boost it, it up like a little bit. like a really interesting... It's set up here. It's really interesting. Yeah. And Violet Aura just it just multiplies itself as it goes through these nodes. Every node that's connected to its system it uses. And down here I've got a capacitor because this takes ten thousand aura per progress. And I've got this capacitor down here to set it doesn't fire off until it gets ten thousand aura. So once it uh -huh. hits ten thousand violet aura, it'll shoot down to that, it'll make that progress one. So. Making you an ingot. Make making me no. It has to get fifty before it makes an ingot. Like I hey. said, it's slow. And that's my gotcha. phone telling me, hey, I'm gonna turn <laughs> off here in a minute. Stupid phone. But tell your phone to not be so stupid. So this one is going. And I hope Let's see, we're up to Yeah, I think it'll I think this will finish. It's going to take a while because Blue Aura does not like it to get pumped upwards. Why is that? It just doesn't it's work just that way? The, it's just the physics of it. I should really put this... Uh, I should put like a, another column up here with a ladder and just put a Blue Aura into something else that will shoot it sideways. Because hmm. it just takes so... a while. It doesn't like to go up. It likes to go down. But doesn't like to go up. <laughs> it likes to go down, but it just it it hates going up. Yeah, gotcha. And white aura doesn't Got care, and red aura like explosive power makes it work better, but it's it's fine. Right. I just need so the I different would... colored auras to make your ring. <laughs> I made me a well of time, Daddy, and I'm gonna do a little bit of work in well getting of some of the... a what a well of Tim time. Why would you I put say? Why would you put Tim in a well? <laughs> Timmy, little Timmy, why are you in the well? Because he's a wizard. <laughs> I'm a wizard. Um, actually, I need. I might. Hmm. Eh, so unsure and unclear of myself. Uh, uh, let me do this. Obsidian. Dave. Can I ask back. possibly a stupid question? No question is stupid, my friend. How do you actually increase the armor of this armor? We have no clue. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That that question though, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's but not that it's a stupid mod, question. So. <laughs> it's just that we don't have an answer for that. I've looked at the wikis. I've looked at the. It, I cannot make it work. I have no idea. That's why we gave you that amazing armor. Here, I'll make you some real armor. <laughs> so, I'm gonna figure this out. Good Let's luck. See, I think. <laughs> I'm going to make... You'll have a set of iron armor up here, just in case. I think I'm going to make one of these. These are the passive forms of um, time sand extraction. So we can sit there... I'm going to make this light fork extractor. So that should passively make me time sand. I'm sad now. With light. Why? Because we don't have bibliocraft and I can't make an armor stand. Okay, that's sad. Mm. That's very sad. Is there a dummy that you can put it on or oh, something? Yeah, I think there is a dummy. I thought I saw something about a dummy. I thought it was test me, dummy. but it wasn't. I wonder if the <laughs> test dummy will work. 
That's a hay bale. I'm wondering if you're talking about me. Nope. No, not yet. <laughs> I refer to myself as a dummy sometimes. Because I just grabbed some more brass when I actually did not Night even time. need it. Nighttime. Nighttime is not the right time. <laughs> no, sir, it's not. Let's see, how much? Where's, where's I... Hmm? I have no Ooh. clue where... He must be sneaking. Where is he? I don't know. Maybe that armor exploded him into invisibility. I'm not sure. I walked away. I found something. I'm looking for something to give you. Oh, God. I hate you so much, Bentley. <laughs> That's going to be on my screen until I break it. <sighs> I love playing with this mod. Okay, <laughs> I'm going to send a bug report that they need to sync their server and client-side stuff. No! Yes! Man, it's all fine, I promise. Ow! Oh. Hurt. Yeah, this has five attack. Wait, what does? The pickaxe. <laughs> <laughs> um, I said that hurt. I don't think it did, actually. Oh. How about that? Half a heart. Okay. Oh, here. You left one of those laying down on the ground. Oh, thank you, sir. I think I might actually need that. Yeah, I need two more nuggets. Um, I have another hour left. Let's see. We'll grab I'd some. really like to go out there and check on my uh, progress on that thing over there. But yeah, it's night. <laughs> um, sure, man. Go, go take a look at it. You really hate me today, don't you? <laughs> Teddy's like, I'm just going to go this way. Check out what I made, though, Teddy. Look at this. The Light Fork Extractor. What does that do? If you, so any of these extractors that you make in here from Clockwork Phase, um, anytime you lay them down and you open up their GUI, like the Light Fork Ooh, Extractor here, yeah. this will show you a hint as how it will generate time sand for So you, you need and glowstone and a torch on it? Or it's just kind of simulating that it needs a lot of light. Oh. So uh, putting light next to it will help it generate times in, except for the fact that we do need a catalyst in there. So I need a light catalyst made as well. So I got to go get that made. And then once we do that, I can have this sync up to this guy right here, the well of time. And that sounds complicated. Produces, it's really not. Your thing actually sounds more complicated than mine. <laughs> This is almost done. You almost have a fairy. Ring. Um, well, then I'm almost done, too. I'm going to almost have something. You almost have a ring of binding. So. I still have an hour left. I think that zombie saw me. Well, tell Fred no. He did. Hey, Fred. Back off. Hey, Fred. No. <laughs> Don't scare Just, me. No. Yeah, oh, it popped off. It popped off. Where's it at? There it is. So... <sighs> Here's the cool thing, Teddy. Hey, you want to see something cool? Watch this. Come here. Um, Just look outside. Um, Just look out the... Look outside. Do it now. Okay. Do you see me walking up and over this? Sure. All right, hold on. No, go back up some more. Back up a little bit more. Yeah. A little bit more. Yeah. Hold on. A little bit more. <laughs> Everything else can walk through it but me. <laughs> and then I crashed. Oh. Happens. It's oh, all... Flying is not enabled on it. What? I was not. I was in the air too long. Oh my god! I was floating in air. Oh, you're back. I crashed. I no, didn't. flying is not enabled okay. on this server. So it thought I was flying because I was standing on your stupid ghost blocks. You probably shouldn't stand on those. Mm. Daddy, don't hate me. So, what kind hey, of fairy would out. you like? No, I don't want to check nothing out you got now. Wait, 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 Teddy, look, okay. I want to say also how much I appreciate you fixing up your soul shard. Teddy got a, a tier 5 blaze shard, uh, soul shard for us, because we made the soul shard, I believe it was last episode or the uh, episode before last. He's got that thing up to a tier 5 for us. He got me some awesome charms from Clockwork Phase that only drop as drops. Even another legendary gear, some more precious charms, ancient coin. So thank you for that, Teddy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, try to save <laughs> I it. I appreciate that. Try to save it. 
What, what kind of fairy would you like? Um, what, what do I what, what do I have to choose from? You have a Bader fairy, which will summon passive mobs to you. Um, a Breeder yeah, fairy, which annoying. will breed things. Uh, okay. Buffer fairy, but we'll have to get into some. Uh, we'll have to make potions of regeneration for that. But that will buff you with uh, random combat buffs. Debuffer fairy, okay. same thing, except we got to make potions of poison. Uh, digger fairy, to increase your dig speed. Extinguisher fairy, that will remove nearby lava and put out fires. Uh, fetcher fairy, which will pick up nearby items. Like a magnet. I'm being okay. chased oh, to half oh. heart. I want that one. I want that one. Oh, you want the fetcher? Yep. Um, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll come. I'll come save you. Who, who's, who's and what's killing you, Fred? And and skeletons were out there. But anyhow, I have something for you, but I'm not going to give it to you out here. Yeah. Um. Here, oh, let me take care of this. Which which which? Ah. Oh yeah, this thing doesn't work in water. Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. <laughs> this is really bad. Nice, <laughs> ah, Tom. All right, we're good. Phew. All right. Oh no, I'm out of bricks. Do we got clay? Oh yeah, we have a ton of clay over here, Daddy. It's on this side. Oh, look how much clay we have. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I ran the digital miner. Oh, for clay. Oh, what is this? Um, he got us a magnanimous tools tree sapling, Teddy. He got us a how sapling. How do you do? How do you do a sapling? It takes like two weeks in game time for it to grow, though. Daddy, look at that. It doesn't even have a proper name. It doesn't. It, it's not even localized. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Is that not interesting? That's crazy. Style dot sapling dot name. Okay, so you want the? Oh, I would love to have a magnet like you, you want know. the fetcher fairy. Okay, so I need. Need an arcane white gem. That's gonna take a little bit, I think. Do, 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 do. So this is so cool, Teddy. Check this out. Look what, at the arrow sticking out of your face and back. That's awesome. Probably. Check oh, out the inside. Wow. Of this. So there's a I have light no idea catalyst. What it means. <laughs> do you see? Do you oh, see geez, that? I, that was weird. Yeah, keep keep watching. So what's happening, right? This light catalyst that's inside of the uh, fork extractor, it's, it's generating time sand, right? Yeah. So once I linked it together with the time tuner to this well of time, oh, wow. anytime it, sends, it has enough, it sends a large dose of it over to the well of time, and it allows it to store it in here. So I can actually place more in there. If I place, like, say, for instance, my pickaxe up there, it'll store time sand in there, or I can actually pull it back out if I put my clockwork pickaxe down here. So I could use this to now go get me some more temporal nuggets if I wanted to. Oh, so what can we do with the time stamp? Um, I'm still working on that. Oh. <laughs> I think <laughs> I it to make myself some more temporal ingots and nuggets at some point. Um, maybe just use it as I have been at the moment just to get some right. more. But um, the cool thing is we can pretty much pick up the well of time and move it anytime we want. So it's really oh, nice. Oh, that's cool. Yep, it retains everything. I love One it. Diamond, and that should start working. Okay, so by the end of this episode, I should have you a fairy. Ooh, well, I appreciate that, good sir. Whatever. <laughs> well then. <laughs> How about that? So nice. Yeah, well... Do you do either one of you have ten levels? Um, I have seven. I have thirty. Daddy has thirty. He's Mr. Special Guy. He is so special that he could not sleep yet again one more night. And you know what happens when Teddy doesn't sleep? Oh, Should we haven't shown that. Do do you know what happens when Teddy doesn't sleep? Things appear from nowhere. Did you know that things appear from nowhere? Did you know that this house appeared when Teddy could not sleep one night? And as also this barn, do you know what else happens when Teddy can't sleep? Let's go look, Teddy. Uh-oh. I think he jumped on my bricks. He did. He couldn't fly. <laughs> I'm so sorry. 
<laughs> so, so Teddy, let's let's show everyone what you have worked on here. Oh, first. Yes, first. That is downright. Don't stand amazing. on his bricks too long. Yeah. The server doesn't like it. Don't even worry about him. Oh, what? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Just come over to the silo. <laughs> yeah, so don't, cool. don't stand on his bricks. <laughs> Here, stand on this brick. This brick won't kill, kick you out of the game. Lies. <laughs> I can't even remember how to get there. It's up here. <laughs> um, yeah, Turn left. Come up this way. There you go. <laughs> Here, put this in your hand and right click. Oh, never mind. <laughs> That works too. First thing is the amazing door. Yes, Ma Malice's doors are downright amazing. I, I hope I'm saying that right. <laughs> it looks so cool, Teddy. La -dee -dee, dee -dee 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 oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. I'm the last one through. Let me close the hatch behind us. That's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> then I've got these custom that. doors, and I'll show you how to make those. Those are cool. All right. They make cool noises. <laughs> it is so cool. It's, They're so yeah, fluid. I sign in, and I'm in here, and I'm like, great, he brought me to a block server. That's awesome. And then I realized <laughs> what it was after looking at it once I got rid of difficult life. Yeah, he had the difficult <laughs> life bug. <laughs> oh, yeah. That, <laughs> He's yeah, like, I can't see to, nothing. <laughs> on our clients, we've had to disable um, that mod. Yeah. Well, it wasn't oh. enabled on the server, so I guess it freaked it out. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, these yeah. doors. That cool. These doors are amazing. Basically, I, I, I just also use... like how you can see them behind the uh, transparent technical block. Yeah. Too. And then I made yeah. some. Uh, I made some impossible, impossible objects? objects. Yeah. Which aren't impossible. Yes, they're just micro parts. I, I don't believe you. I think they're impossible to make. There's no way to make a round object in Minecraft, and you did that. I don't know how. Uh, yeah, with dude. this recipe, uh, cover, slab, slab, block, <laughs> slab. <laughs> They're not hard. I promise and you. an unstable ingot block? Yep. Huh. So, Teddy, would you mind using some of those levels to make me my hammer that I have the pieces for in my inventory? Huh? Oh, oh. yeah. I could. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I love this, like, hourglass thing to get around so fast. It's so nice. I should make one for Teddy. One what? One of these hourglass things. Why would I want something that can make me fly? Because it's cool. Ah, whatever. <laughs> Teddy is like bah humbug. <laughs> oh, did I do that the wrong way? Yes. Mag hammer works. I won't. Uh, it, it doesn't have to be named um. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing. I don't know why I did that. I don't know if I should do this now. Mm. Why? I was going to put something mean on there. I'll just do that. This, this thing generates time sand very quickly. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> I named it Heart. Oh, how cute. <laughs> What's it called? It's a heart. <laughs> oh my god. Less than three. <laughs> totally less than three. Totally less. Okay, uh... Okay, so I need... Chests around that. So I guess I'm gonna have to go put my, uh, crazy blocks when I want to get something elsewhere, huh? Yes. Alright, alright, I'll put them somewhere else. Somewhere I can't see them would be the best. So we need... Um, can't my brick on the Oh, I got somewhere? the bricks on there. Bricks. That stinks. Arcane White Gem gives me a fairy charm, and then I give it four chests. Okay, come here. Who, me? Where are you going? Yes, you. Uh, then who? Hello. 
Hello. Oh, hi. Hey, hey, what's up, man? Okay, put what that you in your bobble slot. It is an auto equip. I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Gotcha. Oh, it says 0 of 15, Ring of Binding. Yep, get that. Okay. okay. What's this do? Right click. Right click. There you go. Okay, that's cool. Now. 1 of 15. So are you, you telling go. me you can have up to 15 different. You gotta wait for it to start taking effect. Yeah, you can have 15 different fairies on her. It should pick it up. There it goes. Nice! That is so cool, man. Oh, that is really cool. I have to say, for one thing, Teddy, thank you for that. I appreciate it. I love having magnets. I have this thing about picking items up, and when when there's like a magnet involved, it's like, yes, please. Uh-oh. I'm breaking the <laughs> ground. Are, are you having fun? Huh? No. Are you, you're not? No. no. I wish you were, man. Wish you had some fun. <laughs> See, you don't even have to walk over to those now. They just su get sucked to you. See yeah, how I help you yeah. out? See how I'm I help you I'm out? I'm doing this in a, a safer environment for everyone so the server doesn't misrecognize anyone's footsteps. Good lord, man. Like, this is a little bit better. I don't know if there's a better way to actually get um, these temporal nuggets at the moment, but it seems to be a pretty efficient way at the moment to get these because... Um, at the moment, like, my time sand is generating, like, a lot. And it's able to fill up my pickaxe in, like, no time flat. So, I can get nearly, like, a stack of temporal nuggets, which is, what, eight or nine ingots. Yeah. And then I can use that to pretty much make just about anything I want. I'm thinking about making a uh, pocket watch here real quick. Mm. Um, a little bit of stoon. Um, I think we're at 30 minutes. Oh, are we, Teddy? I think are so. Are we? Well, then I might have to hold off on this until next time, because it might take me a minute to craft it. <laughs> you think? <laughs> yeah, it might be just a little bit, but I would like to do some of these other extractors as well. I think they would be pretty awesome, but we'll do that another time. So I'm going to go ahead and say I think that's pretty good. Come check this out real quick, Danny. Oh. Let's uh, show, you, show you what I set up. It's pretty much what I had, but um, I'm doing a little bit of work up here in my, uh, I, don't, I don't know, my clockwork tower, I guess. I'd, call it. I have no clue what it is. It's fancy. I can Eww. sit here and like, wind up my tools just about anywhere I want. Or my armor. How'd you get up there? I gotta come check this up. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. How did Ooh. I get up here? Ooh. Easy. I went like this. You jumped. <laughs> How many block step assists do you have? Uh, the longer you hold it, the further up you can go. <laughs> so Holy you. Holy cow! Whoop. <laughs> Jeez. I can just. Whoop. <laughs> you literally can walk over mountains and huh? Just about. Just about. Jeez. So here's 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 my whole thing I'm about this uh, life or light force ah! extractor here. So yeah. There's our well of time. This is going to be able to be accessed from the bottom or the top level up here. And I'm going to have a floor up here that's going to have a couple different extractors. At the moment, I just wanted to demonstrate, probably, in my opinion, one of the easiest ones. Um, this is, is very light. passive. Um, there's a couple of the other extractors require a little bit more, um, I would say, work. Some of them do. Like, the Death Fork extractor requires you killing mobs ah. or passive animals, and it'll generate time sand. Uh, but this one passive, so you just sit there, have to put in the catalyst, and then you don't have to do nothing else. And it's going to constantly generate a, a large amount of time sand for us, which then I can use to make more nuggets or... I don't know yet. I'm not sure what else I can actually do with it. So, right. I think it's pretty cool. Hmm. Seems I think it's pretty nice this far. It is. It's really nice. I like it. But anyways, Eddie, I think it's time to go ahead and wrap up for today. I want to say thank everyone for watching. We really do appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Um, if you guys have any helpful tips, tricks, or comments, feel free to put them in the comment section down below. I also want to thank Shade for joining us today. And Thanks for having me. Dude, no problem. No problem at all. And I want to say thank you to everyone else that's been watching the series this far. We do appreciate you guys. 
rating the videos and supporting us and viewing and watching and enjoying and laughing and cutting up with us. We do appreciate it. So thank you guys for that. Um, any words of wisdom, Teddy? I like pie. I like potatoes. Speaking of which, I had a like tasty mashed potatoes steak. today. <laughs> it's wonderful. So thank you guys again for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, we'll see you guys then. Goodbye. Goodbye.